Good morning, it's Dr. James. Hey, it's so great to see you. Thanks for your time and thank you for your energy. And today I want to unveil an amazing idea for you. Are you ready? Here it comes. Da, 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 da. Possibilitarian. Hey, don't you love it? Wouldn't that be amazing if that was your diet of choice? Just look at that. It's just so powerful. Could you imagine if that was the way that you went into each and every day? You were a possibilitarian. You said to yourself, you know what? I got this great idea, or I have this amazing vision for my life, or I've got a phenomenal opportunity. And then, when it's the natural inclination, neurochemically to say, oh my gosh, you can't do that, that's impossible, or who do you think you are? You can't accomplish that. Then you say to yourself, absolutely, because my diet, <laughs> I'm gonna keep on doing that. You know, my diet's a possibility. I say, you know what, I'm gonna give it a shot, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna lean in, I'm gonna change my belief system. I am gonna grow into the higher expression of what I wanna bring into my life, and I wanna do it right here and right now. Do you have ideas? Do you have a vision? Do you have an inclination, a, a, a wonderful thing inside of your heart that says, gosh, if you could pull this off, this would be absolutely awesome, and you can do it. Because if you have an idea, there's a pretty good opportunity that idea is there for a reason. The universe, spirit, God, put it inside of you to allow you to say, am I gonna absolutely realize it? Am I gonna actualize it? Or am I gonna talk myself down and play small? Well, I'm gonna share a little story with you about this gentleman right here, Goran Krop. Goran Krop, and you can see what he's doing right here. He's on his bicycle, he's got the Himalayas behind him. Well, Goran Krop had an idea one day. He said, you know what? I live in Sweden, and I think it would be pretty unbelievable. Frankly, it might even be impossible for me to ride my bike from Sweden all the way to the Himalayas. I'm going to ride my bike from Sweden to the Himalayas. And when I get to Kathmandu in Nepal, I'm going to actually get off my bicycle, and I'm going to take all of this equipment right here that I rode behind me all the way from Sweden, over almost 300 pounds of stuff, and I'm gonna get off my bike, and I'm going to then get on a trail, and I'm gonna walk from Kathmandu to Paul to the foot of Mount Everest. And then I'm gonna put on a backpack, and I'm gonna climb all the way to the top of Mount Everest with no oxygen and all by myself. And I'm gonna summit Mount Everest, and I'm gonna turn around, I'm gonna walk all the way down again, and then I'm gonna walk back to Kathmandu, Nepal, I'm gonna grab my bike again, and I'm gonna ride back to Sweden. And you're saying to yourself, no way. Because <laughs> that's what I said, I read that and I was like, there's no way, he didn't ride from Sweden to Nepal. He didn't get off his bike in Kathmandu and then climb all the way up to the, the, the base camp of Mount Everest and then climb Mount Everest by himself with no oxygen all by himself, climb back down and then ride his back, bike back to Sweden. That's impossible. Well, you know what? Goran Krop was a possibilitarian and he did just that. So if you today have an idea and you're thinking to yourself, I wonder if that's possible. And I gotta tell you, I've had a lot of ideas in my life that oftentimes I've managed to almost talk myself out of them and then I've decided I was gonna be a possibilitarian and I pursued them. And I didn't always, was, I wasn't always successful, but I really felt successful because I moved towards them. I gave them a great shot and oftentimes I actually did become successful at these things. Today, you are going to be met with a lot of different visions, possibly some dreams, a, a, an idea, a belief, and you're going to have an opportunity to talk yourself into, love yourself into, believe yourself into becoming absolutely what your mind's eye and your vision and your heart has for you, or you're going to talk yourself out of it. So I would love you to take this picture to heart. I'd love you to see Gorn inside of you. He's a human being who decided that a possibilitarian was the diet of choice that he was gonna give himself permission to nourish his mind and his spirit on all day long. And I believe today, you and I, we can nourish ourselves with the idea whose time has come. You and I stepping into the rare air of being possibilitarians. So with that, I wish you much love, many blessings, and every possibility that you desire for you is ready to come through you. Peace and love. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.